After you open the app, you'll see a camera screen. Tap the Erasma logo at the bottom of the screen to go to the menu. Tap the icon of the person in the bottom right corner. Then select the second option in the top menu bar called My Auras. Tap the plus icon on the right to create a new aura and select Aura from the pop-up menu. Tap Device in the bottom right corner and then press the plus again. Then select either Camera or Photo Album depending on where you'd like your overlay to be from. Then choose whether you'd like a photo or a video. This is your overlay, which will show up over the top of your real world image. Give it a name and tap finish. If you're asked to create an aura with your overlay, fantastic, say yes. If not, simply select your overlay from the menu and tap select. This will take you to a camera screen to photograph your trigger image. This is the image that your overlay will go on top of. Make sure that slider at the bottom of the screen is in the green zone. This means the image will be easy to detect and the Oreo will work better. Once you are happy with your trigger image, rotate and resize your overlay to ensure that it fits well on your trigger and then tap the arrow to proceed. Once again, name your image. Make sure that public is selected and it's added to your channel. Then tap finish. This will take you back to the camera screen where you can test that your aura works. Hold the camera to your trigger image and there you go. You've just augmented reality using Aurasma. Well done.